Hey guys, Eric 740T here. I just wanted to cut apart the um, Hobby King power distribution board and have a look and see why it just won't provide the current flow you need, and it just doesn't. Um, here's the problem. You got these two nice big connectors. You got some decent sized, uh, I don't know what it was, 10 gauge. 10 gauge? It was probably 12 gauge. 12 gauge wire, uh, maybe 14 gauge wire coming out of there, and they're all soldered on nice, nice soldering. Um, problem is, all there is is a t tiny little film of copper that is uh, sending all your power through this. The whole thing. That's it. Nothing fancy about this. It's just a tiny little thin strip of copper. And there's no way, you know, it's probably not even the equivalent of like a a 26 gauge little copper wire. It's, it's probably less than that. So no wonder I was having current problems and my uh, ESCs and motors were burning up. So just wanted to get into that and show you, hey, that's why. It's a scientific fact. It just can't do it. For a small quadcopter, it'd be fine. And I cut it up uh, just to prove a point, and you probably couldn't see much in the video. But, um, you know, check out my DIY one, my uh, DIY video on uh, the uh, how to make a cheap power distribution board. And it's a whole lot better than this one, I promise you.